And now that you're a mom of two, do you yeah. think you're done or do we want more kids? Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I think you found my these. answer <laughs> just in that, you know, sigh. Um, no, I think right now I'm done. You're done. You know, two kids. I have my boy. I have my girl. Like I said, I have my little family. Yes. And I feel complete. And how does Corey feel about that? Corey feels great. Yeah, he's happy with that too. <laughs> he's happy with yes. that too. You know what I mean? We're no longer these spring chickens, should I say? <laughs> um, you know, it takes it takes a lot because I'm a very I'm very hands-on mom, mm -hmm. um, and also I love what I do. I love my job, so. It's it's a lot. Mm -hmm. It's a lot, you know, of trying to balance things out. I really don't believe in balance mm -hmm. um, or trying to balancing it all. But uh, yeah, I think I think we're done. Good. Yeah. Good for you, girl. <laughs> Obviously, being a mom, a lot of people deal with this. How do you handle the pressure to get that snap back yeah. post pregnancy I, I, body? I don't. You, you, you know, don't. when I was when I was younger, mm -hmm. you know, it was something that um, I thought about. Mm -hmm. But now that I'm older. I've embraced it. Yes. I'm like, this is me. This is who I am. And you know, I just finished doing um, two Christmas movies. I did one mm -hmm. for Hallmark and Lifetime, and it was right after I had my baby. And some people thought I was crazy, um, but I was like, no. I want to inspire the moms out there that just because you have a baby, you, you don't have to give up on your dreams and your aspirations. If your dreams are to stay at home and be a stay-at-home mom and take care of your child. Kudos to you. Totally. But I don't think that you should give up on your dreams and your aspirations just because you've had a baby. So after I had my my daughter, she came with me. She was in tow. That's awesome. You know awesome. what I mean? And I'm still breastfeeding and all of that. Yeah. But um, you know, I said, who cares what anybody thinks or says? You know, just because I'm a few pounds bigger, um, this is who I am. Completely. I love me. I'm embracing who I am. And if I love who I am, then who cares what anybody else thinks? So yes. Yeah, there's no pressure. I will be back to where I am when I want to be back. So. You go, girl. Yeah. <laughs> that is a great message out yeah. there. Because so many people like have a really hard time oh, dealing yes. with that pressure. It's crazy. I think they do. I think just because you know of what societal, uh, what their standards are. Mm -hmm. You know, some people think that that's something that you have to do. Yeah. But I think when you have more examples out there of women mm -hmm. saying, "This is me. This is who I am. It takes me a little longer to snap back." That's okay. Totally. You know what I mean? It's fine. Everyone has their own journey. They do. Yes. They do.